Specialty food products like this jar of gourmet olives are growing in popularity. And that's why today we're in Taunusstein, Germany to visit Feinkost Dittmann. Feinkost Dittmann is the company that makes these kind of products. Today we're going to find out how they're manufactured and distributed. It takes sophisticated technology to churn out thousands of jars of fine food products every day. Feinkost Dittmann is one of Europe's leading brands of gourmet foods, especially those with a Mediterranean flavor. Gourmet olives, peppers, sauces, antipasto, anchovies, seasoned salmon, caviar, and pasta salads are just a few of the 1,300 different products that Feinkost Dittmann manufactures. Our company is now around 114 years old. We are the second generation. My father bought the company in 1970. And we produce and develop the antipasti fine fruit from the Mediterranean Sea. The company operates four production plants in Europe, but the main facility is here in Taunenstein, Germany. Just a few years ago, the company built this automated warehouse to hold ingredients used in manufacturing its many products. The ingredients arrive in these barrels and tubs from all over the world. Olives and peppers from Greece, Turkey, and Spain. Capers from Uzbekistan. Salmon comes from Alaska. And garlic from China. The company decided to go with an automated warehouse for these ingredients because the available land was limited at the site. And automation takes up much less space than a conventional warehouse to store the same amount of products. Inside the new warehouse is an automated storage and retrieval system that can hold as many as 12,500 different pallets of ingredients in three temperature zones. Frozen, refrigerated, and ambient or regular air temperature. Cranes move the pallets up and down five aisles of 15 levels of rack positions where the pallets are stored. The German company Krohn's supplied this system along with the management software to operate the entire automated warehouse. When ingredients are needed in production, the software alerts the automated handling cranes to retrieve pallets holding these precise ingredients. The pallets are then loaded onto a conveyor, raised by an elevator, and transferred to a shuttle system that transports the ingredients through an overhead bridge to the production building. Once there, forklifts take the ingredients to line positions where they are added to product preparation. About 300 pallets are sent to production every day this way. It's very fast, very quickly. So when we say in the production we need this item, then it comes out. Before we work with the paper and then the people must run to look to find it and this is a big advantage for us. In all food production areas, sanitation is critical. Workers wear special clothing and masks to ensure that purity is maintained. This facility makes a wide range of food goods, including fresh foods sold in grocery stores. Fresh ingredients need to be washed and made ready for processing. Here, olives are rinsed in large vats. Workers then take some of the olives and mix them with pasta shells and other ingredients to make delicious fresh pasta salads. These are packaged into store-ready containers. Elsewhere in the building, jars are sequenced to receive sauces, peppers, olives, and more. Krohn's also supplied some of these high-speed filling machines, choreographed perfectly to receive just the right amount of product. Once filled, the jars are capped and labeled, making sure that the language on the label matches the destination market. Some of these finished goods go back into the automated storage warehouse where they would be held for a short time until trucks arrive to take them to market. The automation here at Fine Cost Dittman makes certain that its production facilities can keep up with demand, delivering the finest in quality foods each day to customers in Germany and around the world.